should take that, and I know you were in the booth. Oh, come on. Team. You guys, if it's not college field hockey, I don't know anything about it. That's, uh, that's, that's, you know, right. that's I'm what you're focusing doing. on the Maryland game. Yeah, college field hockey. I'm not following that. All right. Speaking of games, the new transition team uh, started meeting three minutes ago there on Capitol Hill in uh, Washington, D.C. Uh, about 20-some-odd uh, members of, of the new incoming class and joining the transition team. The Republicans have got to figure out how, now that they've got power in the House, what they're going to do. Yeah, how to govern. That's always, that's, that's always the harder step than winning. Uh, look, they, they obviously have to um, assimilate all these new Tea Party not co-op them. But assimilate them into the, you know, how Washington works. But you have the Tea Party folks and a lot of these hardcore conservatives who are, who are thinking, gonna slide so, this window open. wait a second, you know, I was just elected by people who are kind of sick of the way Washington works. So those two forces have to come together somehow and then turn it into a blueprint for governing the country, and at least from the House of Representatives. I think it's going to be fascinating. Hurry up, there's scary. Yeah. Work, yeah. But it doesn't surprise me at all that these Tea Party folks are getting some plum assignments. They should. And then, Laura, on the, on the Senate side as well, I mean, you see some, I saw an interesting story today that even somebody like uh, Senator Dan Coates, who uh, is actually returning to the seat that he used to hold, will, will yeah. be considered a freshman. And so that might create a little bit of tension on the other side of the house. Uh, yeah, fresh, fresh face Dan Coates. What's not? <laughs> I love Dan Coates. He's, he's a great guy. But look, it's about the spirit, all right? It's not really about, you know, whether you served before. It's about this wave that these, these uh, new senators and congressmen rode in on. And, and I think uh, John Boehner has said this is unlike anything we've seen in modern times since the 1940s. We've not seen anything like this. So you, you can't just pretend it didn't happen and, and do business as usual. I think it's very hard <laughs> Yeah. No, Here we go. Let me hold him down lower. Mm -hmm. Way to go, boobies. Okay, honey, we gotta go. To stop it, I just shut it off, right? 